Hey guys, in this video, I will say about child outing. So guys, when you open a component into a another component, that's called child outing. Before child outing, if you don't know how to create out, so go to the description and watch the video how to create child outing. So guys, before child outing, I will tell the here is the component I created in the previous video. Here is the add contact employee header and home component. And I also route, route this component. So I will show the preview of this project so here is the browser and you can see the preview here is the home if i click it's it will open the home component and if i click about component here is the open about component and if i click contact component here is the open contact component so guys now i will create a child outing into the about component so here is the about component and now i will add a button employee button and when i will click the employee button then here will be open a employee component into the about component so for this guys i have to uh, i have to create a button into the about component so uh, i i will go to the about component and here is the about component and i will open the about component not html file and now here we'll add a button so here button type button and i will name it employee and here is the button and I, I i save this and now i will open a browser and here is the uh, employee button also added into the about component and now i will click the employee button now here will be open the about employee component so for this and now i have to generate a employee component and so i will go to the terminal and here i will open a new terminal and now i will generate a employee component so the command is ng g for generate and c for component and the component name is employee now i will press the enter and you can see the employee component is created so i will go here and i will refresh it and now you can find here the employee component so here is the employee component and now i will go for route so for route uh, i will go to the app module.ts and in the previous video i told you when we generate a component here this component imported automatically so you can see the employee component is imported automatically so now i i have to copy this comp this imported component so i will copy this and now i will close the app module.ts because we don't need it now uh, and now i will open app routing module.ts file and here i will paste the imported component which i copied from app module.ts and now you can see i it is imported here and now i have to route so i, I will route into the about component because i want to open this component into the about component so for this i will press the cursor into the curly bracket and now i will press enter and i will type comma and now here children children is the keyword and type brackets for array and now curly bracket path colon double inverted comma and here is the path employee comma then it will be open the component is employee component so here is the route is completed now i have to add the router link and now i will write here router link equals to double inverted comma and the path name is employee so i will copy it and i will paste into the router link and you notice here i didn't type here slash because it's the child child outing here don't need to type slash because otherwise you will get error so now i will save this and i i will type here router outlet
and I will save it. So the router outlet is where is the employee component will be open. So I call here router outlet. So now I will open the browser and if I if I uh, click the employee button then here should be open the employee component into the about component. So I will click the employee button and you can see the URL is changed. Here is the about slash employee and now you can see the employee works that means employee component is open into the about component so if this is the child routing so guys now i will show you how to redirect employee component directly that means when the page load will be completed it will be redirect to employee component into the about component so the how's the how is the route so i will go to the route app routing module dot ts file and i will route here so i will place the cursor here and now here i will be type the curly bracket and path if the path is about then it will be redirect to about slash i will copy the employee path and paste here and path match full and the here the comma so guys that means if the path is about then it will be redirect to about slash employee component and now i will save it and go to the browser again and you can see the page load is completed and here is the employee component automatically load open into the about component so guys if i click home component then then it will be open home and if i click the about component then it will be open about component and also employee component redirecting so this is the redirect 